Welcome, Aquarians. This is the month of Julie business reading. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back, Aquarians. Let's see. Um, Aquarians, it looks really good for you guys in this month. Remember that these readings have been extended. Please go and check out the extended of the readings. The quartals are up. Use the energy um, in this month and check out uh, um, the readings, okay? So what we see here, I love using the Buddha, the green Buddha. Um, there is um, a lot that is happening and transpiring, but it's good. It's going to be a good month for business for you guys. Um, however, this is happening and transpiring for you Aquarians. It is going to be a really, really wonderful month when it comes up to your financial and uh, business and work. So Aquarians, uh, thank you for being here. Please remember to like and share these videos. Leave a message and let me know how it's going with you and what has to inspire. Okay, so as you look, we have the energy of belief. And this period, this month of July, you need to believe in yourself. Whatever is happening and whatever is transpiring, believe in yourself is the only thing that is going to be helping you and is going to be creating your financial wealth and uh, whatever it is that you want in your career. So believing is going to be a very, very, very important uh, avenue for you Aquarians because you have to um, believe in yourself in order to create your own wealth in whatever you're doing. So we have, uh, I believe that uh, um, each check I write brings money back to me tenfold. And this is so true because a lot of people are not aware. Every time you do something good, it comes back to you tenfold. So if you do good to someone, um, really, it always, always um, come back to you tenfold. And this is going to be wonderful and positive. So this is a, a really, really a positive alignment of energy that is going to be coming up for you guys. Because what you're learning is that as you do good things for others, you are going to be receiving good things coming back to you. Um, here is a situation where I see whatever is happening and transpiring. I see that some of you are dealing with a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius at the workplace. This person came up. So um, whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring, there is going to be some legal issue or this person is going to be fired. So whatever is happening, you're having some issues to deal with this person. There is definitely going to be some legal issue with this person or this person is going to be fired for something that they have done. So you got to believe in yourself and understand what is transpiring. So this is um, really, really beautiful. This um, month at five weeks. And as we look, we see the five weeks. So um, the problem is that some of you were expecting an offer from your boss. Okay. And um, this offer will definitely come in for you guys. But whoever this man is, um, your boss is not really in a positive line of energy. So you guys have to be aware of this. If you have a, a boss, uh, there is some situation that is going on with the business. And this person is not really in the most positive mind of things at this moment. This person is dealing with some issues and um, the issue has to do with his business. You could be doing business with this person or is um, connecting with this person in order to create something together and ho hoping and waiting for an offer from this person. But I don't see this offer is coming in for this person. So you got to be aware of the issue and the situation that is um, transpiring. So whoever this person is, I see no offer coming in from this person. Um, so you got to be aware of this and you got to be on your guard because obviously whatever the issue and the situation that is transpiring this person seems to have a problem and this is coming up as your boss so um this person could be also leaving so you have to be aware of the situation that whoever this person is could be leaving what we see on top of you which is very good the energy of the star so i see um work and your um it, um your performance is um, excellent. There is no, not going to be a problem with your 
bosses and managers because you Aquarians, your performance is very good. Um, what you're understanding from this old reading is that you can see um, that whatever you have to face is with a younger Aries Leo or Sagittarius person and they are the one that is going to be having some issues to deal with a boss. Um, this is a young lady, whoever this young lady is and whatever is transpiring, definitely um, you're going to be finding out uh, that maybe you have to fire this person or I see the boss and people in power is looking at this person because obviously it's someone who works with you and I see the energy of the king of cups and whatever is transpiring. If your boss is a king of cups, uh, um, they're going to be working together with people in power to resolve a situation with this person because obviously they're seeing that there is some disruptancy and some deceptiveness that this uh, young Aries Leo or Sagittarius ever creates. So I see especially you managers, if you're an Aquarian and you're a manager, I see that you definitely there is some issues that is going to be coming up and is going to be transparent. So be aware because I see some of you are going to be making a decision whether or not to um, give this person a contract going forward or not. So um, this um, issue is going to be playing out for a whole lot of you. So be aware of what is transpiring with this young person because some of you have some inkling about this young person and your inkling you're right on target about this person and who this person is you're really right on target so be aware of this because obviously you are definitely going to be finding out some situation about this young person what they have done and what has um definitely transpired on the workplace that this person could be creating some issues for other people um, their work ethic is not on top of the game and that sort of a thing. So I see in this month of July, some of you are definitely going to be deciding what you're going to be doing with this young person, whoever this young person is. Their work isn't on top and you're going to be making a decision. So um, the top of the month, it is a month, the energy of the star, whatever it is. A month comes in with the energy of the star it is beautiful because what it is saying is that um you are really on top of your game and uh, um this is um just absolutely fabulous and um this this situation is showing up in a really 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 um positive way and this is um definitely definitely going to be good so be aware of whoever this young person is. I'm going to shift it over. I see you're protecting yourself from this young person. Whoever this young person is, is very deceptive. So you have to be aware of who this person is and whatever this person is doing and um, affecting um, your department. Um, maybe it's someone that you are considering to take on or not okay so be aware of who this person is so there is a lot that is happening there is no question about this there is just a whole lot that is happening so let's go into this month and see exactly how this month is going to be coming out and what to look forward in this month so in the first week um there is some issues where there is an energy of the tower. Now, this energy of the tower, when you look at this energy of the tower, this is saying that something has ended in the month of June. So it could be a contract or it could be someone contract. It could be reorganization. It could be um, a transformation that is coming in. And however, this transformation is coming in, it is coming in very positive because of whatever the obstacles and the issues that was created around you by other people, whatever the deceptive um, play that was created around you um, by other people, I see that this is uh, going to be lifted up and this is going to be a uh, clearing is going to be coming in when you are going to be realizing and seeing how beautiful it's going to be transpiring in your world because whatever obstacles, issues that was blocking your career or your money, um, or your business, it is going to be lifting up as uh, you leave uh, and as you come in the month of July and leaving the first week of July, it is going to be lifting. Now, some of you were definitely having issues with your boss or some of you were having issue 
um, with this man. Whoever this man is, is a Taurus, is a Virgo man. Whoever this Virgo man is, has been blocking some of you for quite um, some time without you even knowing. And what I see come in here, because the star is on top and um, at the bottom, is as if people have... Um, People at the top or people in a business um, connection with you have seen that this person has been creating some issues in your world for quite some time and they are going to be removing this person. And this is a wonderful alignment of energies because what is happening and what is transpiring is that um, whoever this person is and whatever their motive is, I see that... Uh, um, they are going to be releasing and changing their motive of what they were doing and transpiring, okay? So, um, um, this is actually a very, very, very positive alignment of energy that is going to be coming up for you guys. So, um, you know, life is full of surprises and sometimes we're not aware that sometimes the universe just come in and bring us out of whatever the deceptive play is that is happening and is transpiring. And this is why I say to people, go back and look at uh, the extended third quarters because, uh, and extended monthlies because uh, you would have seen the situation is coming in. So in the second week, there is a, a, a really a success in the second week, a success for you Aquarians that uh, um, whatever that was transpiring in your life, you were blocked. You were blocked for quite some time and you were dealing with issues uh, um, that was creating a lot of problems. Like there was this manager or there was this person at the work floor, who, whether or not they liked you or didn't like you, or there was a professor that was giving you low marks uh, so that you could not pass. So however, this is coming up and transpiring and um, the energy of belief in yourself, knowing that whatever it is that someone that was trying to create a block in your way so that you do not uh, um, create a, uh, that wealth and that stability and that flow of energy in your work and um, creating negative energies around you at the workplace, this is going to be released or in your business, this is going to be released because they're not giving this person another chance. So some of you could be finding out that your boss um, is not going to be receiving a new contract and you could be um, asked to fill in um, for his position. So this is going to be good. And this is really wonderful because what you're seeing happening here is that uh, um, this person is removing out of the way um, because uh, they are not functioning in their position and the position is going to be given to you. So this was um, someone who was um, really um, blocking you for a very long time without even knowing this person has been, um, you know, sitting in your life, blocking you um, from moving forward. And now they're realizing who this person is because here is the two of ones and there's no new offer coming up for this person because they realize the deceptiveness what this person has created. And I see a tower moment. And this is definitely a boss for some of you. Some of you is a supervisor. Some of you, it is um, the manager that was running the company. And I see that they're going to be going out and, uh, um, and um, it's going to be, um, there is going to be an opening that is going to be coming up. And this opening is definitely going to be helping you guys uh, moving forward in a very positive way. Okay. So um, that is really, really wonderful. That is good news. Um, so I see a lot of you could be um, moving in and getting management position. And this is wonderful. However, this is transpiring. It's as if the universe is uh, removing things that was uh, creating obstacles in um, you moving forward and getting these eye pro promotion that you, were, you are always looking for. And the universe have a way that uh, um, it, it will teach you a lesson in order to keep you at a uh, um, a certain place in order not to move so that you can understand what the lesson is. And sometimes people say, so um, Jesus, haven't I gone through more? But sometimes, especially if with business work and creating your own career and your own destiny, there is just certain situation that you need to understand that 
you don't just get out of college, get out to school and then get in a very high position. You have to start from the bottom and work yourself to the top. And I think that some of you have really start from the bottom and has been working yourself to the top. And this is where you're going to be aligned now with the positive energy of yet. Yeah, they're saying, okay, so you are ready for this position. Okay, so this is going to be absolutely fabulous. As um, so situations in the third week, um, definitely um, you guys are going to be dealing with your boss, whatever is transpiring. Um, some of you, um, the second week, a tower moment. So some of you could have changed jobs, career, and that sort of a thing. And the third week, you are definitely dealing with this man, whoever this man is and whatever is transpiring. Um, this man seems to have created some obstacles because they are the blockage. Okay, they are the blockage. And th that is what is have created some blockages and is going to be creating some blockages. But if you notice, you're going to be successful and you're going to be coming out of this, especially business people. You're going to be successful and coming out of this because they are basically realize who this person is and what this person was doing. As we look at the fourth week, the fourth week is a very beautiful week. The fourth week is that people, whether or not you have a job, I see you're focusing on creating something for yourself. And people who have a job, I see um, you are um, totally going in the flow of energies with what you're doing. Um, you are very talented. Your craft is very good. Um, success is here for you. Um, you're showing up and you're showing also that you are capable enough uh, to do whatever is asked of you. And this is very good. So this is really a positive alignment of energy, if you ask, because what is happening and transpiring is that you're you're standing up, you're showing up, you're um, letting people know, hey, 